Assalamu alaikum grade 2 and a very good morning to all of you. How are you all doing? Good. Okay, remember me? Who am I? Miss Umama. Very good. Okay. So it's your uh, and who's going to tell me which class is this? It's numeracy class. Perfect. I have written over here as well. Okay. So um and uh, did I give you any home assignment yesterday? Yes. What was that? Which topic we discussed in yesterday's class? We learn about equal to more than and less than, right? Okay, so did you practice that? Okay, who is going to tell me about, um, okay, I'm, I'm giving you two numbers and you have to tell me which number is great, okay? Okay, the numbers are 13 and 17, which is greater? 17, okay. Uh, then the next numbers are 25 and 20, 29, which are greater? 29, excellent. Okay, the number between 53 and 35, which is greater? 53 and 35. 53, excellent. Okay, which number is greater between 13 and 13? They are equal to each other. Excellent. And what is the sign of equal to? The two lines, right? Okay, so uh, who is going to tell me uh, what which number is greater between... 25 and 22. 25. Excellent. Okay, which number is um, small in between <coughs> 9 and 8? Which is the smaller number? Number 8. Excellent. So this means that you guys are very, very familiar with now this, that how we can, um, what is this less, uh, more or less than concept, right? Okay, and do you understand about the, the signs as well? I told you that we use this sign for, um, and the, the, the open part of the sign would be toward which number? Toward the, toward the greater number, excellent. And the pinpointed side would be toward the small number, excellent. Okay, so in today's class, we will be talking about uh, the, um, the number lines. Uh, we will practice the number of uh, num uh, number of digits in words on the number me and the number line i have drawn this number line for you and what you have to do is i'll be asking you about any number and you have to tell me the number uh, of uh, that digit in words okay okay let's start from the zero i have drawn this number line and i, I started it from the zero why because it, it is there are whole numbers okay okay hassan you're you are supposed to do the first attempt what you have to do is you have to start from zero, skip two numbers and tell me what would be the next number. Skip two numbers, start from zero, skip two and tell me what would be the next number. If we start from zero and skip two numbers, what would be the next number? What would be? Three, number three, excellent. We started from zero, we skipped one and two and the next number would be number three. What are the spellings of number three? Yes, someone else this time. Yes, Hamza. Please tell me the spelling of three. T H R double E three. Excellent. Okay. Um, Sarah, your turn. Skip one number from three and tell me what's the second number. Skip one. You will be skipping four. And what would be the next number? Number five. Yes. And who is going to tell me the spellings of number five? Okay. Yes, Elise. F I V E five. Excellent. Okay. Let's move forward. Adila, you will be skipping three numbers and tell me what would be the next number. Skip three and tell me what would be the next number. Six, seven, eight. You are supposed to skip three numbers. So you will be skipping six, seven, eight. So what would be the next number? Number nine. Excellent. And tell me the spellings of nine. N I N E nine excellent okay <coughs> let's play a sm uh, small mental math activity you are supposed to tell me the answers of these questions very quickly and then you have to tell me the spellings in words as well okay what comes before five four spellings as well F O U R four excellent what comes after seven eight spellings E I G H T eight. What comes before five? 
four. F O U R four. What comes in between two and three? What comes in between two and three? Is there a number between two and three? No. So what comes? Nothing. Okay. What comes after zero? One. Spellings of one. O N E one. Excellent. What comes after nine? Ten. And the spellings of ten? T E N. Ten. Excellent. What comes in between five and seven? Number six. And the spellings? S I X six. Excellent. So ah uh, now all of you should open your notebook. Sorry, your book, your workbook. Open page number four. This is page number four, and the question, the statement of the question says that count each set of objects and write the numbers and the number names. Write the numbers mean that in in the first column you are supposed to write the numbers in the form of digits, and in the second column you will be writing in the name of words. Okay, you have to write in both forms. Okay, there are two columns meant. First, there are number of objects. You will count them. Then, in the first column, you will write it in the form of digits, and in the second column, you are supposed to write it in the name of in the form of words. Okay, okay. The first is already mentioned over there. There are loins, and how many loins are there? Ten. Okay, wonderful. And what are the spellings of ten? T e n ten. Okay, who is going to tell me how many birds are there? Okay, you have to raise your hand. Follow the rules. Raise your hands and wait for your turn. How many words are there? Count them. Okay, Eliza raises her hand for C S Eliza. Nine, excellent. And what are the spellings of nine? N I N E nine. Okay, write it. All of you are done. Okay, good. Okay, can anybody see any footballs in the in on this page? Any footballs? Yes. How many footballs? Four. Excellent. Right. Right. First four in the form of digit over here, and then write F O U R four in the next column. Okay. Can anyone see any burger in the page? Yummy burger. Yes. And how many burgers are there? Only one, excellent. So write one in the first column in the form of digit, and write O N E one in the second column. <coughs> Sorry. Okay. Can anybody see any apples in the in the page? How many of them are there? Count them. How many apples? Yes, Sara. They are seven. Excellent. So write seven in the first column and write in the in the form of words in the second column. What are the spellings of seven? S E V E N seven. Excellent. Can anybody see any ice cream? Or ice cream shake? How many? Three. Okay. Write P H R double E three. Okay. Who is going to tell me what is left? Is there anything left? Yes, a cute baby, right? Okay, how many of them are there? Five. Wonderful. Write five in the form of digit in the first column, and write F I V E five in the second column. Okay, write it down. Okay, are there any more birds in on the page? We have counted one birds which were on the second on the top of the page uh, below the loins. Are there any more birds? Yes, there they are, on the bottom of the page. The birds were there in the second line, and the birds are there again in the second line. How many birds? Only two. And what are their spellings of two? T. No, not T O W. T W O two. Okay. So we are done with this page. That was all for today. So what we did actually today, we revised number names from one to ten. I told you uh, in the start of the week that in this week we will be revising what you have already covered in your previous um, classes in your previous grades in your previous grades and all of you were familiar with this right you you know the name of the uh, digits in the words and then in the form of digits as well right 
So excellent. Um, uh, keep revise what we have covered in the whole week and prepare yourself for the quiz that will be inshallah tomorrow. Uh, it would be a small weekly assessment that we will be um, that I'll uh, take from what we have covered so far in the week. So if there is any question, you can ask me. The topics that we covered in this week were in the first class, we did identification of number. Then in the second day, we talked about missing numbers. Yes. On the third day, we talked about more than less than concept or greater than as well. And on the fourth day, we write the name of digits in the form of words. So we have so far covered four topics. You need to revise all of these four topics and tomorrow i'll take a small weekly assessment from you first we will revise quickly all of these and then i take a small weekly assessment from you i can take that on the board or i can take that in your notebooks as well okay so that was all for today uh, do revise all of that prepare yourself for the quiz take care and office